what was uh, going on there, and uh, was it just simply uh, you know want that got you guys uh, 27 offensive rebounds? It definitely was. I think on the rebounding side, we wanted it more, and it showed on the court. And that was one of the keys of the game, and we executed that really well. We'll go to the third row on the inside out. Um, Kayla, um, you finished with 30 points, but the team had 27 offensive rebounds in comparison to 29 field goals converted. When you're given those extra opportunities, whether it's you or whether it's other teammates, um, how much easier is it for you to be able to get into some offensive sets, um, to be able to reset, and then quiet down the crowd? Yeah, I think offensive rebound has been one of our strengths since the beginning of the season. I think that we really harp on that during in practice. We have great people who really navigate the ball off the rim. And I think that just gives our guards confidence to use the ball because they know that um, we're going to get the rebound and we're going to get extra possessions. And that's really important in games like this when we win by two or three possessions. And this is a great team that we just we just won against. So those extra possessions are really, really special. Come up to the front row here. Michaela, talk about going against their number one. She's long, mobile, active, and, and the chore that that must have been. Um, yeah, she's, she's big, and I mean, like, just props to her. She's she's young, but I think that she's going to be a great player here at Maryland and as she continues to grow. But yeah, it's hard to go against people who are taller than me, but I think that's something that I've been doing all year. I'm a little bit undersized at my position, but I just have to find ways to score in different ways, whether that's going around people, elevating over people, and things like that. We'll go to the third row, second seat.